birthday present. All right. Love you. Love you. In a rare turn of events, Travis Kelsey finds himself in the midst of a performance slump, expressing his evident frustration after a lackluster display in the recent defeat against the Philadelphia Eagles, a game that fell below his usual standards. The Kansas City Chiefs tight end, renowned for his stellar contributions, concluded the match with seven catches for 44 yards and a touchdown, a performance that, by his own assessment, fell far below the bar. I've got to be better, remarked Travis Kelsey in a statement provided by the Chiefs. I'm just not playing up to the level one have in the past. I've got to be better. Kelsey's season has witnessed a roller coaster of highs and lows. After an impressive start with 17 catches for 155 yards in the initial three games, followed by 31 catches and 370 yards in the subsequent three, the tide took a downturn in the last three games, with Kelsey managing only 16 catches and a mere 116 yards. The Eagles, in their strategic defense, effectively limited Kelsey to five catches for 33 yards in the second half marking an improvement from his previous two games, where he managed only two catches for 15 yards in the same period. The stakes were high for Kelsey, facing off against his brother Jason and the Eagles. Despite the loss, Travis Kelsey, who had never been defeated by Jason before Monday's game, offered congratulations to his brother. However, when questioned about the emotional aspect of playing against the Eagles, Kelsey chose to remain silent. On the other side, Jason Kelsey didn't delve into the specifics of Travis's emotional state after the loss, indicating that such discussions would occur at a later time. I didn't really say nothing, I knew he was frustrated, shared Jason Kelsey after the game, as per the Chiefs' transcript. Especially down the stretch, I'm sure there are some plays that he's beating himself up over. I didn't really know what to say, he said, happy belated birthday, he didn't get me a gift, so I guess that counts. He's not too happy, obviously, I'll talk to him this week. Interestingly, Kelsey's performance appears to be influenced by the presence of Taylor Swift at the games. When Swift attends, Kelsey averages 8.5 catches per game and 108.0 receiving yards per game, whereas, in her absence, the figures drop to 6.0 catches and 41.8 receiving yards per game. Kelsey, attributing the struggles to internal factors, emphasized, it, isn't, anything that they did. It's all us. As Kelsey grapples with this performance dip, the coming weeks will likely see intensified efforts to reclaim the exceptional form he is known for. Fans and football enthusiasts are left to ponder the trajectory of Kelsey's season and the potential influence of external factors on his on-field prowess. Feel free to share your thoughts on Travis Kelsey's recent struggles and how you think he can bounce back in the comments below.